Hi, I'm Bill from Guitar Center. Today I'd like to show you the Martin D42. This is a 14 fret style guitar in the dreadnought body from Martin. It's been around since the late 90s. The very first one was made in 1934, and that was the only one made until the 90s when players were wanting vintage guitar features and the D42 was resurrected. It's a solid Sitka spruce top with East Indian rosewood back and sides. Very nice figuring on this guitar. It's got a vintage toner or sometimes called an aging toner on the top so it just darkens it a little bit to make it look like it's an older guitar. It has ebony bridge and fingerboard. It has what Martin calls style 45 snowflakes. They are made of abalone pearl. And of course, the thing that hits you in the face about this guitar when you first look at it is all this phenomenal abalone trim around the top called purfling and of course the rosette and goes down around the fingerboard. I mean, this is the real deal here. And by the way, this stuff, each piece of this is cut by hand and placed in here like a little mosaic. It takes quite a bit of work. The back strip is like a mosaic. It's incredibly done. If you look at this up close, you'll see it's made up of a lot of little pieces of varying woods. The binding on the guitar is called grained ivoroid. So it is a synthetic product, but it has a texture to it and it has a coloration to it that again makes it look quite vintage. The tortoise shell color pickguard is beveled and polished. It's a higher end pickguard than the Nora plastic one. Inside the guitar we'll find scalloped and forward shifted bracing. The bracing under the top is what keeps the string tension from pulling the top off the guitar. The spruce top is a soft wood chosen for its vibrational qualities and tonal qualities. With 170 pounds of pressure pulling on it all the time, without the proper reinforcement inside, it will pull up and pull off actually. So the bracing patterns have been established and the Martin X bracing pattern is one of the most commonly used. This one is forward shifted a little bit. Although the braces are on the inside of the top, they are carved by hand in order to lighten their mass so that they do not detract from the top vibration. It's a very delicate balance between too much braces and not enough. Not enough, the top fails. Too much, it mutes the sound. The tuning machines are open gear, vintage style, with what we call a butter bean tuning knob, which is this little guy here. That's what that shape comes in. Again, brought back from a long time ago in terms of stylization, they just look great. This guitar is designed for just about any musician. The big dreadnought body provides a lot of bass and extra volume. It is the most popular guitar body in the business today. And it was actually invented by Martin, if you didn't know that, but it was invented by Martin. And so it's copied by just about everybody else in the guitar business. This lends itself to any style of music, folk music, country music, flat picking, bluegrass, you name it. If you can play it, this guitar can take it. You can play this guitar at a Guitar Center store near you, or you can see it online at guitarcenter.com.